Assalamualaikum and hello everyone. Today's science year 5, we are going to learn about close switch and open switch with me, Madam Norafida. The objective for today's topic is that the condition of bulbs when a few switches are opened or closed in a series and parallel circuit by carrying out activities and the success criteria is to investigate the relationship between the conditions of switches and bulbs so this is Ravi he has connected two switches in the circuit to observe the conditions of the bulbs when these switches are closed or open so what will happen to the pub if i open or close the switches what is closed switch or open switch in this series circuit this picture switch x is closed and switch y is opened and this one switch x is opened and switch Y is closed. So do the bulbs light up? This is an arrangement of the bulbs and the switches in a series circuit. So let's watch this video. This is switch X, the bulbs, and switch Y. If I close the switch X only or close the switch Y only, do the bulbs light up? What will happen if I close both switches? What is the condition of the bulbs if I open or close the switches in the series circuit? When either switch X or Y is opened, both bulbs do not light up. This is because the circuit has become an incomplete circuit and the electric current cannot flow. Now let's take a look at the parallel circuit. When switch X is open but switch Y is closed, bulb B in the second branch still lights up because electric current can flow through this branch. When switch X is closed but switch Y is opened, pop A in the first branch of the electric circuit still lights up because electric current can flow through this branch. This is an arrangement of the switches and bulbs in a parallel circuit. Let's take a look at this video. If I close one of the switches, the bulb still can light up. Let's do this experiment. I want you to write this experiment in your science report book and then fill in the table given here. That's all for today. Thank you for watching and listening. See you in the next lesson. Bye.